Hey everybody, Dr. Rafi Waldir. Hope you all are doing well. Going to talk to you all about REM behavior disorder. This is a really important concept in clinical neurology and in sleep medicine. When we sleep, we go through different stages of restfulness in our sleep. There's stage one sleep, stage two sleep, stage three sleep, and REM sleep, rapid eye movement sleep which is an area of sleep in which if you actually look at a person while they're sleeping and their eyes are closed, you can sort of see their eyes darting around behind their eyelids. And the reason that this happens is because they are dreaming during that time and it's sort of like they're looking around and looking at different things. And while we are in REM sleep, our bodies are supposed to be somewhat immobilized. We're not really supposed to be moving around. And that's kind of beneficial considering the fact that we do tend to dream during that time. If we are not immobilized, then we tend to act out those dreams. And when that happens, that is called a REM behavior disorder, which can be a component of a number of different uh, larger disorders like Parkinson's disease and diffuse Lewy body disease, or it can just be something that stands on its own. You know, a person might have a REM behavior disorder with nothing more serious attached to it, but it is something that is treatable. But again, it's an important concept for people to understand. Hope this information helps. Talk to you all soon. Bye-bye.